You know, what's interesting about, you know, driver's licenses and when, when it comes to the criminal law is it's a separate hearing, right? So you have this administrative hearing and then you have a criminal proceeding. So if I got arrested for uh, um, DUI and I called you, Bob, and I said, I got a problem, I actually have two problems. That's right. We have to defend the administrative suspension for either allegedly refusing or if you did take the test and they got a breath test over the legal limit for your applicable age group, 21 and over, it's 0.08. If you're under 21, it's .02 or over, and if you're in a commercial truck, no matter what your age, .04 or over. So if you reach those limits, you have another type of suspension that all goes to DDS, and then DDS, if you don't do anything about it on the 31st day after you're given that form, uh -huh. your license is suspended, so you better get to an attorney quickly. You only have 10 business days to file an appeal to protect your right to drive. And that's very important. And Jennifer, how long is it suspended for? It depends on whether or not you took the test or not and what your prior history is. Every time that someone has a suspension administratively due to a refusal, it's always a 12-month suspension. Um, if it's a test case where you've, you have taken the officer's test and your blood alcohol came back above the per se thresholds, um, the first one, the, the earliest you could reinstate is 30 days. The second in five years, the earliest is 18 months, and the third in five years, it's five years. So, so if you're a repeat offender, then the time that your license is suspended is extended. Now, if it is suspended, let's just say it's my second in five years, your two in five scenario. Is there an opportunity, if it's 18 months, can I come in and say, can I drive for anything? Can I apply for a permit? Can I, is, there, is there any wiggle room or am I sitting you know, on a bicycle for 18 months? If you're talking about a second administrative license suspension based on test results, yeah. there is not a permit available. Okay. There is one for a first in five years, but there is not a permit available for a second in five years. The only permit that would be available for that scenario is after you've been convicted of that second DUI. Okay. And that's why sometimes if people get that second one, they're going to go ahead into court and get the case over with so they can get moving on that, that suspension issue.